Hi everyone, this is Jen of One Stop Apothecary Shop. Thanks for joining me today for a weekly stock update. I have a lot of great new things to show you guys. Um, some are new, fresh on the market, so that's kind of exciting. Uh, as far as the sale goes, not sure what I'm going to be having on sale this week. Be on the lookout for that. For any of you watching me on YouTube, feel free to subscribe and join my Facebook group. I do giveaways and also post some videos and extra things on there. And I'm also on Instagram. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, first up, new in the shop, I have this Echo Park collection. This is brand new out. And this is the Winnie the Pooh collection. And I wanted to show you guys this. So this is the 12 by 12. I'm selling all these together. This one's a 12 by 12 kit. It's got 12 sheets of paper. And then it's got um, a 12 by 12 sheet of stickers as well. And this is the classic poo. Very, very beautiful. It also comes with some chipboard phrases. I'll show you guys. Comes with some ephemera. These are like little die cuts. And then some adhesive brads for embellishments. Those are super pretty. All right, so check the store out for those. Okay. Um, let's see, listed some Alta New this week. This is the Gardenia Build a Flower. And this one comes with the matching die. There's the die. And this one I actually have in my personal collection. So I wanted to show you guys what this one looks like die cut out. I do have some of these flowers that are die cut out. Yeah, it's a nice, very pretty size. Did a lot of different colors with that one. Okay. There is that. Next up on the list. Let's see. I have a set from RG Studios. This one feels photopolymer. Um, this one's called Seasonal Mug. I thought this one would be really cute. It's got some Christmas and Halloween themes on it. And it's a nice six by eight size. When I was at Creativation, I signed on with a wholesaler and she's gonna be, she has a lot of these Lisa Horton um, embossing folders. This one I came across in a craft room clean out and I wanted to show you guys, um, I joined Lisa Horton's Facebook group too. She's got some beautiful 3D embossing folders with matching dyes. Um, but yeah, I'm looking, going to be looking at carrying more, a more variety of this brand in my store. They're from the UK. Very, very good quality. And the die cut like butter. I made a card with it to show you guys kind of a sample of how this looks. I 3D embossed the background, put on some Ulta New Pigment Gold ink, just brushed it on a little bit. And then these are um, the dies. I even cut out some vellum, vellum there to give it kind of a layered look. So it's a nice slim line card. Okay. New in the shop. I have plenty of these on stock if you guys are interested. These are the Nouveau Gilding Flakes. And these jars are, let me see, they're almost seven ounces. These will last you forever. A little bit goes a long way. And I might be doing a video on um, techniques for gilding flakes. They're kind of an older product that has made a resurgence. Um, and you can put them on with glue pens, with adhesive tape, and they look, they're absolutely breathtakingly gorgeous. They look a lot like foil. I put a bunch of heartfelt creations up this week. Found a big stash of these. This one's called Cottage Lifestyle. All of these in the shop are cling mount stamps, very good quality. And then a lot of them come with the matching dies. Um, and then on the back of each of these are, I also show it in the listing, our measurements of the stamps so you guys can see, see how big those ones are. Here's just another one that I listed, blossoming coneflower. But yeah, feel free. There's a few more in the shop. Check those out. You can find them on their Heartfelt Creations. Okay, let's see. What else do we want to show you next? This one's a lot of fun. This one I listed this week by Paper Smooches. 
Um, these always sell really well for me. I don't believe they're in business anymore. So they're kind of hard to find. This one's called Body Language. This one's so stinking cute. It's for, um, I think like transplant patients or people having surgeries. Wanted to share that one with you guys. All right, sorry for the plastic noise. This just came out by Pink Fresh Studios and I am loving it. Loving it, loving it. I actually put this in my personal collection. Um, and I'll try to do some videos on this set. This is called Artsy Floral. In my listing, you can see some samples as well as um, there's a picture of the washi tape all nice and rolled out. But yeah, this one has got to be my one of my personal favorites from Pink Fresh. I absolutely love these floral images. They're kind of like, they almost look like watercolor. And anytime I need a sentiment um, or a saying, Pink Fresh always has the most beautiful sayings that... Uh, that come with their stamp sets. I reach for them a ton. And then the dies actually cut out the watercolor images, and then they also cut out the sentiments, which is really cool. And of course, the washi is stunning. It's got some floral or foil accents on there. And then it comes with the layering. Let's see, there's six of them. Layering uh, stencils as well. I'm send, selling these all in a group. So you get the whole collection with this kit. I have a couple of those in my shop. Okay, let's see here. I think next up, I got so much to show you guys here. It's like, oh, what do I do next? I get excited. Okay, when I was at Creativation, I came across here. I'll put them up here. I came across these. These are by Nuvo. They're glacier paste. Let me zoom in so you guys can see the colors a little better. But they come in these absolutely gorgeous containers. They look so pretty. So if anything, they look great sitting on your shelf. Decorative. Um, I've shied away from the glimmer paste, selling the glimmer paste in the past because I don't like how gritty it is. Um, this one, I actually got to see a demo and I got to play with the consistency. And I also played with these last night as well. Um, they spread like butter, you guys. Very, very smooth. They're pretty quick drying. I think within an hour, they will be all dried and nice. Um, and Nuvo does an amazing job with the shimmer. So this is this one on white. And I plan to do a video very soon of the techniques of how to use these as well. Let's see, this one, what is this one called? This one's called Pixie Wings. But yeah, the shimmer and shine is just incredible. And then in that video, I can show you guys how to use them. I'm planning on um, die cutting some images with these. And then they also show up, at, they actually get even more sparkly on um, black, if you can believe it. And then this one, this one's like they're, they're white. And this one, let's see if I saved it. What I did, I was playing with it last night. This one you can basically make, um, make any kind of color you want. So last night, shoot, I can't find the sample, but I added um, just some Distress Ink refill to this and it made a really pretty nice blue with the Uncharted Mariner. All right, so yeah. Check those out. I have lots of those in stock. I ordered a bunch when I was at the show because I fell in love with them. Okay. I've listed some more of my favorite things this week. This one's super cute. It's called Monster Love. I have this one and then I also have another one listed. Same kind of theme. This one I think is super fun because you can add any kind of face that you want on the monsters. I think it's cute. came across a ton of stamps of life stamps um, so I'll show you guys some of those this one is under stamps of life candy corn and this one's a super cute uh, alphabet set for Halloween it comes with a little die here's a gingerbread one also comes with matching dies you can dress him you can put his little face on and give him little buttons so that one's super cute. This one's pretty funny. 
you like punny ones. Stamps of Life is really good at punny ones. This is the PB and J set. So yeah, and then this one comes with two stamps and then the matching dies to cut out the peanuts and the jelly and yeah, the little jars. Okay, um, also brand new this week from Kindred Stamps. This one is called Hoodwinked. I believe it's from Robin Hood Men in Tights based on <laughs> the cute sayings. Okay, and finally for this week, although I've listed a ton more, feel free to check out my store for the rest of my listings. Um, I listed these as a group. These are a lot of fun. They're just Tim Holtz Distress Crayons. And this is a great, um, great set of three. They are either uh, new or barely used is what they look like to me. I tried to check every single one. All right, guys, be on the lookout for a sale. I will post something here in just probably a few minutes. And I thank you for your time. Have a great week. Take care.